And they want you. They want you, Tauros. They want you. They, you know, they want to take you away from this person. Hello, my beautiful Tauros soulmates. Figured I start my astrology videos. So, we're gonna start off with Tauros. Even though, well, yeah, Tauros season has started. So, we're gonna start with you guys and we're gonna go in order of the zodiac. And hopefully, I can pump these out like ASAP. I'm gonna be pretty busy actually this week, but. We shall figure it out. Now, those are gonna be just general predictions for Tauros. Now, if you have Tauros anywhere in your house, that could be ascending, that could also be in your moon, okay? Um, or even if you're looking at your charts, uh, this message could apply to you. So that's just gonna be predictions for May 2021. Anything goes. Um, we do have some romantic cards here. So if that's where the reading heads, we will definitely talk about romance. Now, it is a general reading, so not all the messages are going to apply for everybody. I'm just going to move this back here. Because I got so many cards. Here, let's put this here. I want to have basically all the desk space I can. Alrighty. Oh, so you know what? I want to start with an angel card. Alrighty, Tauros 2021. What do your angels have for you guys? What do they see in your future? Peaceful resolution. And what do we see with Jesus here? What does Jesus have for you? He wants to give you this message, y'all. I'm telling you. Y'all y'all haven't been wanting to hear it. Oh, I flipped two cards over. Okay. Nice, nice. We have... I will not leave you comfortless. I will come to you. John 14, 18. Be of good comfort, your faith has made you whole. Matthew 9, 22. Hmm. And peaceful resolution. And then Jesus is talking about comfort and making you whole. So there, there's some sort of like drama going on here, I feel. Uh, there's some sort of situation that you Tauros are facing. Um, I want to draw the tarot to see what this is but i can't help but feel like for some of you it's work and then for some of you it's relationships and then i feel for some of you it's also both like you're 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 being really hit hard um but yeah let's let's figure out Taurus 2021 <clears throat> The cards are just brimming with energy. You guys have something. I don't like that. Tauros 2021. This is it. The King of Pentacles. Alrighty, I'm back. Just had to tend to something, but it's dealt with. So we have King of Pentacles. Um, I just wanna, you know, I, I just wanna draw out the cards. The Seven of Cups in reverse. Hmm, that's interesting. Actually, I don't know. Well, you know what? I pulled it out like that, so it's gonna stay like that. Because obviously they feel there's a message there. And then the King of Wands. So you have two kings here. This, uh, th there's a very masculine, um, energy. Okay, that's definitely a love situation here going on for you, Tauros, in May 2021. There's some sort of, uh, love connection here. And... It feels to me like this 
person, it's like they come in and they sort of like, they kind of like want to take control. Uh, you know, I don't want to say that, but it's like they're very possessive of you. They're very possessive of you. And I feel like for some of you, you've already met this person or you're currently in a relationship with this person. And it's like, that's why your angels up here, they're saying peaceful resolution, like try to resolve this peacefully and you know, don't, don't make it a, a huge shit show. Uh, but it feels like this is inevitable with this person. Um, you know, I, I don't, obviously I never want to think badly of anybody. I think, we can all agree with that, but I just don't get a good vibe from this person that you, you, you Tauros are, um, you know, you're going to be dealing with in May. And I feel like for some of you, you have been dealing with this person. I feel like for some of you, you have. Um, can you clarify this? King of Pentacles and, oh my gosh, Nine of Cups in Reverse. The Nine of Cups in Reverse, and you have the Seven of Cups in Reverse. Can you give us more information about this person, Spirit? Thank you so much for your messages. Truly grateful. And the Nine of Pentacles. But they say flip it in reverse. They want it in reverse. This, you, okay. Um, before I draw any more cards... This is a very, uh, you know, this person that is coming in or this person that you're currently seeing, okay, you Tauros, uh, this person is very restrictive. They, they seem intimidated by you, um, and by your power, uh, and they're also intimidated by the fact that you're very attractive, okay? You're a very attractive individual, um, you have, you know, a very, uh, kind heart, a very, you know, soft energy, and it's very inviting, and, and you're very, you know, you, you attract people naturally, uh, you, you know, you have sort of like a fire energy, like a, like a vibe of fire energy, you know, like a Leo energy, kind of, and, um, it's weird, they're like saying the name Tina, they're saying the name Tina, they're also saying time out, and then my left knee got like a little, a little itch just right now. Um, so yeah, if any of that resonates with you, Tina, time out, okay? An itch in the left knee, maybe you have an injury in your left knee, maybe somebody hit you there. Um, or you know somebody that has an injury there or something. I don't know, but they, they are sending that, so... If you're watching this that might be your sign that this is for you right but it's like this person really doesn't want you to do anything they seem really uh controlling it's like they feel the energy of your success and they don't want you to be a success they want the success for them this person wants all the success for them they 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 want to be the one on top calling the shots it's almost like they want to put you, put, put you, they, they want to put the battery on your back. They want to put it on your back, you guys. Okay, you Tauros that are watching us. They want you to do the, the work, basically. And then they want to take credit for it. This person that you're, you're seeing now or that you, you are currently seeing, okay. Um, <clears throat> I, I'd be... I'd be careful with this person because they, they're very seductive, you know, they, they have a, a very, uh, charming and alluring and comforting presence, but it, it just, it's not worth it. And, you know, with the Seven of Cups in reverse, I also feel that, uh, there's, there's a lot of people looking at you, okay, you Tauros that are watching this. You, you, there, there's a lot of people looking at you right now, okay? They, you know, they're, they're very, they're very, uh, attracted to you, uh, and they fantasize about you, you, you Tauros watching this, um, and it's like this person is really like, eh, and then it's like, what you're passionate about, eh, your business, eh, and you know, it's, or your career, eh, you know, like they want to just get in, and, 
uh, yeah, this person, uh, I feel like they have issue, uh, sex issues, um, oh my, let's see, the, the energy was like, of exhaustion, I, I feel that some of you have been with this person for a while, and it's just exhausting, like, like, I just, I sighed, I was like, oh, like, like, I felt the energy come out of me, summer, bask in joy and light, yeah, it's like you, it's, it's like you've been, like, like, hidden away because of this this person um or like they want to they want to keep you hidden away um they just they they just like i don't know they they just they don't want you to find a passion or a purpose they don't want you interacting with anybody they don't want you to work or start your own little business. It's it's like, what does this person want you to do? It's almost like they just want you to be a, a slave that, that cooks and cleans and gives them sex. Like, that's... I, I, honestly, I don't... Uh, Hunter, track down your fears and desires. Yeah, it's... They're, they're like giving this message like it's time to flip the script. Uh, it's time to change the script here, okay? It's time for you to to become the dominant force. But in a peaceful, loving manner, right? So you don't want to make this like a huge, a, a huge explosion of like fighting and you know, you don't want violence. You don't want any of that so obviously a peaceful resolution seems to me like you're scared to leave this person or or this person is just so dominant and aggressive you're you're kind of scared to like just separate like they're 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 putting like this 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 vibe this energy to you and um yeah it's <laughs> it's like your faith has made you whole track down your fears and desire like have faith in yourself and and your faith will make you whole you know it's like your faith will will tell you what you need to do next and i feel like for you guys you know i said that maybe this could be job too and i still get that here i get that for most of you though it is both career and uh a, a person that you are seeing, okay? Uh, this person is very jealous, okay? Uh, they they want the spotlight on them. And with your job, it, it feels to me your job is just like, like I feel that some of you, um, you you made good money, but it's like it's it's capped out, and there's really nowhere else to go. And this isn't what you're proud to do. This this isn't what you want to be doing for the rest of your life. So yeah, um, but I just want to focus more on the person here. So let's see, Tarot of Sexual Magic, Tauros, May twenty twenty one. Okay, we have the lovers, okay, here. This is the mini edition, so they're small. So this, this, uh... There's somebody else coming in. Um, that's so interesting, but there's somebody else coming in. Um, at the end of May. Now, for some of you, this might not be May. It might take a couple of months, but there, there's somebody else. And this is gonna be like a very, you know, it's not gonna be like a set in stone type of relationship. I feel like it's, I feel that it's gonna be more of an intimate, you know, Netflix and chill sort of thing. Um, and this person is gonna be, they're, they're gonna care about you, but they're a little bit of a player. Uh, they they like to have fun uh, and see other people. So there's like this feel of like, you trying different things um that's interesting there, there's somebody there somebody that wants to like get in there and 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 conversate with you and yeah it's but i also get that this goes to the person that you're with that this person that you're with currently is also a bit of a, a player okay 
he, she, they, however, you know, however they describe themselves as, uh, they are a bit of a player and, you know, you gotta be careful here because, um, I get the feeling that this person might be talking to other people behind your back. Okay. What else? What else for Tauros? This is turning more into like a love reading. Oh yeah, yeah. You, you see, and I know it's like the imagery is male and female, but it could be male, male, could be female, female, okay? Whatever gender you describe yourself as. But the Knight of Cups, you know, that's what I was saying. Like, I feel like somebody is coming in for you, Tauros. Like, somebody is coming in and they're, and they're very like, charming and you know they're not really looking for a relationship but they're they're very romantic um this this person coming in is is very romantic um and for some of you this is happening the the end of may and it's like now i get why the angels are saying peaceful resolution because uh, you, you know, some of you are with this person who is super dominant, and it's like, there, there's a fear there to, to have a confrontation with this person, so, yeah, they're saying peaceful resolution, and what I get here is that if you fear for your safety, then you do this when this person isn't around, you remove yourself, and you go with this person, even though they're not really looking to settle, um, <coughs> they, they, you know, like I said, like, I feel like a lot of people are looking at you, and then this person, he's like, or she, is just like, hey, you know, I've had, I've had my eye on you, Tauros. I've had my eye on you, you know, I'm sort of curious about you, like, what do you say you and I have some fun? And get to know each other this way. I feel like this is a Leo, Sagittarius, uh, you know, Aries. Like, that's what I get. Um, like, a very passionate and, like, headstrong. And, like, this person, if they, you know, if they cross paths with this person you're currently seeing, it's like, you, you want to avoid that because there might be physical confrontation if, if these two cross paths, this person, this new person, does not like this person. They they will not get along. Um, yeah, this, this is a very headstrong individual. But they're charming, and they're nice, and they are not going to treat you like this person is. The Magician, okay, so yeah, this this is somebody that gets what they want. They get what they want. This person coming in, this new person. Somebody that gets what they want. And they want you. They want you, Tauros. They want you, they, you know, they want to take you away from this person. And I feel like for some of you, they know about this person. Like they know that you're, you're in a relationship with this person, but they, they, they want to take you away. They want to whisk you away. They want to take you away. Like they've had their eye on you, Tauros. They've had their eye on you. They've been eyeing you, okay? They've been manifesting. They, they've been imagining that, that moment. They've been imagining and, you know, I'm gonna say it, they've been fantasizing about having sex with you. They have. They, they want you, Tauros. They want you. And it might turn into, you know, down the line, this might actually turn into something. Like a commitment. Like a real commitment with this, this new person. This current person is way too aggressive and dominant. They're, they're not ready, they're not mature enough to have a relationship, okay? Um, so, and in terms of career, what do we have in terms of career? Because that was coming up as well for you, Tauros. That was coming up as well. What do you have for career? May 2021 for my Tauros. My Tauros baby. 
palace of coins. So that's interesting. And the page of coins. They want you to build your own, you know, they want you to start doing your own thing on the side with that page of coins. It's like you're starting something new, okay? A new career, a new business. And specifically because we see the palace of coins here, Palace of Coins is self-sustaining, meaning that it's done by you. You're not relying on somebody else. So this is definitely you starting your own little side hustle, okay? Because we see the Page of Coins as a starting, as a beginning, right? Um, and this is new. This is something that you're really not experienced with, okay? And that's okay because you guys are very much capable of making the money come in, okay? You know, th this this is your 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 uh, element here, right? The Palace of Coins is the Pentacles. This is your element, Tauros. It is Earth. And, you know, so you do have that capability of making your own wealth and your own pros prosperity and... Uh, you can start that May of 2021. Uh, it might take time for the money to come in, but you can absolutely start this May of 2021. Uh, and also, so, for some of you, you're going to have this new person coming in. You're going to have this new person coming in. Um, yeah, and you're... It's very possible that this is going to... Uh, th with this person that you're currently seeing... Uh, it's very possible that this is going to be going to end you know i see here you finally confronting this fear of leaving this person and going with this new person who you know yeah they're they're a bit of a player but they're they're not going to try to control your your career or what you do or you know it's like they want you to shine and vibe and they're going to respect that I feel like this new person respects you as the adult you are whereas this person they sort of see you as like less than and a child almost which is weird because you know they have issues with sex with you so it's yeah but that is your reading Tauros for May 2021 if you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up I wish you love and light take care